And today, Vimalji Kirpa is the five year anniversary of basis of Sikhi Dhu Katha in his Godora side. This Asana Ji, within the past five years, I'm sure base of Sikhi have touched many people's lives in this room today, in this Dharbar side, including Das themselves. And if Das has looked at their own life, in the past two years they've been blessed to walk this path of Sikhi, Sikhi has gone so much that many people who were just normal people became Guru Sikhs. And it started for Guru Sahib's path of Sikhi. And if you look at what Bhai Gurdashi says about this, what they say about many people that come to this world and they inspire other people to follow this path of Sikhi. And Bhai Gurdashi says in their writings, say Guru Mukha, Parupakari, Villa Aya. Villa Aya means someone that's very rare. These very rare people come to this earth and they're known as Guru Muks. Guru Muk means that someone that puts their face towards Guru Sahib. Parupakari, Pari means someone else. But Bukhari means of God, that means to save, to help, to carry your cross. Guru Sahib, Bhai Gurdashi is here saying that in this world is those rare people who come to this earth to help other people. And that's why it feeds our base of Sikhi. That is true base of Sikhi that ours best to come to Sikhi as well. Not just the Pacharaks, but the people behind the scenes, the admin, the Sevadas that stand on the stall outside and they speak to the people that come past. And Sa'a so we can go back 500 years and look at the great Guru Sikhs from then. And we can only go back 30 years as well and see those same great Guru Sikhs as well. This Sa'a Singh, if we go back to 1985 and we look in the card of one Guru Sikh named Pai Amarjit Singh. And Pai Amarjit Singh is living in Punjab. And what happens, three Guru Sikhs come to their house. The first one, Shaheed Rishpal Singh. Second, Shaheed Satanam Singh. And the third one, Shaheed Baba Anok Singh. These three Guru Sikhs come to their house. And they've come to their house because it's too dangerous to walk on the streets because there's a price on their head. There's a price on their head and they have to come to this Guru Sikh's house. And they say, can we stay with you? Can we stay in your home? And of course, this great Guru Sikh says, of course you can stay in my home. But what happens after a short period of time, another Sikh comes right to the house and say, by some, the police are coming. The police are just entering this village and they're coming to your home. So what does Pai and Lok Singh Ji do? Being that great Guru Sikh that they are, they say, we should leave this home. So that's exactly what they do. Let's leave this home because it's not safe for the people in this village if we stay here. And they reach the outskirts of this bin and they now say that maybe we should split up. It's safer if we don't stay together. So they, all three things, decide to go their own ways. And they say we'll meet tomorrow in a safe house. And they say that Gray Guru Fateh, that Guru Gobind Singh Ji blessed us with. And they say Wahi Guru Ji Ka Khalsa, Wahi Guru Ji Ki Fateh. And then they go their separate ways. They saw things within 20 minutes. The police have arrived at Pai Sabji's house, Pai Amarji Singh Ji's house. They come to the house first. They look in the whole house and they can't find any, any trace of any other Guru Sikhs that have been here. And two hours have passed, Sao Sanji, two hours, and the police are still looking. And what happens is Pai Sab goes to the roof. They go to the roof, and they can see the police are surrounding the whole village. The whole village is surrounded by police, and Pai Sab can see Pai Nok Singh. Jonki Market is sitting in the field with the legs crossed back straight in Samadhi, in the fields. And about 150 feet away, the police are coming towards Bai Nok Singh Ji. And Bai Amarji Singh is thinking from the roof, cannot Bai Nok Singh Ji see the police are coming? But he's not flinching, Bai Nok Singh is not moving at all. 
And now police is coming closer and closer and closer, and now they're only five feet away from Pai Sahib. How can the police not see Pai Sahib is right next to him? But Pai Amaji Singh from 60 feet away, uh, 60 feet away can see Pai Sahib in the dark. And also with Pai Sahib and Nok Singh Ji is being protected by Guru Sahib Shabad. They've joined to the Guru Shabad and now nothing can attack them. Nothing can go towards them. And we read this every single day, Guru Ajna Sachi Pasha Ji says with the good bond, he says, Guru Ka Sabda Khabare, Joki Jogi the Hamare. So that when we have Guru Sahib Shabad on our side, it protects us on all four sides. And nothing can happen to us. And on that day, Pai Sahib and Nok Singh Ji were saved. And nothing happened to them. They saw Singh Ji, they had a lot of problems with the law, with the police system. The police always try to arrest Pai Nok Singh. And one time when they come out of police custody, where does Pai Sabji go? They go to Amazon Chat. They go there to help with Seva and to help with Sangat. And when Pai Sabji goes there, they go in there because one of their great friends, Shaheed Salak and Singh has become Shaheed at the time. So they go to his Amazon Chat and they take a hook and off from Gurgaon Sabji Maharaj. And what is this Shabad? That comes up from Tanta and Gurgaon Sabji Maharaj. They're talking Guru Granth Sahib Ji Maharaj is saying that Jo Dina Aav Hai, So, so Dina Jahi. So Jo Dina Aav Hai, that day that comes, So Dina Jahi, that day is going to go as well. What is Guru Granth Sahib Ji saying? He said that time is running out. Time is running out. Bhai Nok Singh Ji, Bhai is running out to those, to those Guru Sikhs that time is running out now. Karana Kooch, Kooch means to march now. We're going to have to start marching now. Rehenda Thira Nahi, that time is running out. Nothing is going to stay here anymore. Then Guru Granth Sahib Ji Maharaj says, Sangat Chalata Hai. The Sang means Sangat. Sangat is going to go as well. Everyone else which your Sangat, they're going to leave as well. Hamapi Nahi, and me, and you as well, you're going to have to go as well. We have to go as well. And in the, in the next Pankti, Guru Granth Sahib Ji Maharaj says, they say, Dur Gavan. Dur means far. You're going to have to go far now. Sir Upar Marna. That on top of your head sits death now. Death is on top of your head. Death is coming for you. And when they hear this, when those Guru Sikhs see this and read this um, Shabbat, one of the Sikhs has tears in their eyes. The words on the face of Pai Nok Singh Ji, they're just smiling. They're smiling and saying, why are you crying for? Did you, know, did you not know that this day was going to come? That when we're blessed with Guru Sikh Ji's Amrit, then we're Tiyar, we're Tiyar, we're ready for anything. And if you look at Pai Nok Singh Ji, we're in their Jeevan, they always did Ardaas to Tanta Guru Sahib Ji and say, Maharaj, please bless me to be Shaheed for the Panth. Please may I sacrifice my life for the Panth. And it comes to that day now, where Pai Sahib Ji Pai Nok Singh Ji is within a prison, where they're within a jail. Pai Sahib Ji has been tortured for many hours, many days. And for being tortured, Pai Sahib is now hanging upside down. They the star, the beautiful Damala is removed from their seats. And their case is dangling. Pai Sahib Ji has been tortured for so long, they've had hot metal rod poles put through their ankles down into their knees, hammered in. They've had a pain put through their private parts and they've been electrocuted. They've had a pole put through their chest. But what is coming out of the, the great mouth of Pai Lok Singh Ji, all they're saying is, Vahe Guru. 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 Even when their eyes have been taken out, even when their hip has been broken, they're still saying, Vahe Guru. And now their eyes are taken out, and all that is coming from Pai's Nok Singh Ji's mouth, they do a dance to Guru Sahib Ji Maharaj, Maharaj, please keep my case intact. Please don't let them take my dubiyad of my case. That case, that before case that Sao Singh we cut so easily today. But Pai Nok Singh, that was the one a dance they asked Maharaj, Maharaj, please don't, 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 don't let them take my case away from me. And don't let them take my sikhi away from me as well. These two things Pai Nok Singh Ji asked for. This Sao Singh Ji, Pai Nok Singh is now lying on the floor. They have no eyes, they can't see nothing. They can't see if it's dark, if it's light. They can't see the time. And what happens now, Pai Nok Singh Ji hears someone walking past and say, Pai Sahib, what is the time? And that person says, it's quarter past seven. And what is the next words that come out by Pai Sahib mouth? In the evening, they start to read the evening prayer that any Guru Sikh reads. They start to read the city of the head of Sahib. And they start to say, Dukha Daru Sukh Lokpaya, Ja Sukh Tamnavi. They start to read the Bani of Guru Nade Sachi Pasha Ji. They saw Singh Ji, you may think that Pai Nok Singh Ji is dead. They're going to die, they're going to become Shaheed. But in Pai Nok Singh Ji's eyes, as long as that Guru Sahib is Bani, then they're never going to die. Because if we look in Siddhi, right there outside, Guru Sahib Ji says in Asa Mahalla Pahala, Akha Jiva Visarai Manajada. When I read Guru Sahib Ji's Bani, when I have the Bani, I can never die, I'm living. 
Desal Singh Ji at that point, by Nook Singh Ji, is reading Guru Sahib's Bandhu Ardas at the end, and they keep reading Gurbani. They're reading Gurbani upon Gurbani. And what do they do? They cut the tongue of Bhai Nook Singh Ji. They cut their tongue off so they can't read it anymore, Bani. But Sal Singh Ji, when I told this Saki somewhere else, a baby, che, a baby ji came up to me and she said that I have had sung of Bhai Nook Singh Ji's family. And you know what they say? When Bhai Nook Singh Ji used to sit there, you didn't just hear Vaigru from their rasna, from their tongue, you heard it from their robes as well, you heard it from their, their case, on their body, on their heads, on their body. They would say Vaigru, Vaigru through their body. So Sal Singh Ji, even Bhai Nook Singh Ji, you cut their tongue off, they still say Vaigru through the whole body. So what does the police do? They shoot Bhai Nook Singh Ji. They make him Shaheed there. And Bhai Nook Singh Ji's great Guru Sikh is made Shaheed. They saw Singh Ji, I'm just going to finish off with one more point and then I'll pass it to Bhai Nook Singh. They saw Singh if you look at the Ithahas, so much Ithahas that we have, so much great Ithahas. And throughout all our history, many of our brothers and our sisters have given their life for Sikhi. Many of them. They're willing to die for Sikhi so Sikhi can live on. But Sal Singh Ji today, how rare is it to find someone who actually wants to live for Sikhi? So please Sal Singh, let's live for Sikhi today. And hope you want to be blessed to die for Sikhi as well. So please forgive all the mistakes that I've made and I'll pass on to Bhai Sarup Singh Ji now. If you enjoyed this video, please like, comment, share and subscribe. Please donate and help spread Guruji's message. Link is in the description below. Vaheguru Ji Ka Khalsa, Vaheguru Ji Ki Fateh. Thank you.